six hours later, back at the airport, no clouds, and we are ready for an uh, island hopping tour to Corsica. Somebody's tired. <laughs> well, welcome to Genoa. <laughs> 4 30 a.m. I said early morning flight. Our flight is around uh, 50, 51 minutes over the ocean and that's why we have to wear a life vest. We do it, clip take off, left turn after, hold the go Victor. Hotel Gravito report approaching a unit point to change the frequency with uh, Milan. Wait, call, Hotel Gravito. Control, control, yeah. Hey, morning, we were super quick. One hour after the alarm, we already took off of Genova. Currently, we are at flight level 85, climbing flight level 95. So our leg is now inbound Tortu. Tortu is an IO4 waypoint. We are flying VFO, but since there are no visual reference points uh, over the sea, uh, we have to go for IO4 waypoints. Just past Tortu, uh, our waypoint. And now we turn the left to heading 153 and the island is already in sight. The next point will be the airport of Bastia and from there we're flying along the east coast uh, with about maximum 1000 feet. We are flying over Corsica, currently at 1,500 feet. We just passed uh, Bastia Airport. We are now doing the VFR route on the east coast of the island. We already saw the island of Elba, which is part of Italy. And we can see a small island over there. And it's just lovely at 1,500 feet. So green, so alive. You have these small little villages all over the mountain. It's uh, just really, really good.
Corsica. We arrived on point, seven o'clock local time, as planned. And we are super happy to be here. It was a great trip, especially uh, the Via Four route on the east coast on a very low level. Next steps, we have to pull back the aircraft, then we ordered some jet fuel and then we have to look for a rental car so that we can explore the, the island together with you. So Rima, what are you doing? Um, yeah, taking care about the rental car. It's very good if you're a crew of three because yeah. someone can take care of the fuel. I will take care of the rental car. You have done something about the hotel, Accommodation, right? Accommodation, exactly. Um, why we are doing this just now? Because I think this is for safety. Um, if you don't book anything in advance, then you are super free to also go back to divert to another airfield. If you already have the rental car and hotel booked, then you maybe stick to the plan and you make a decision which is not so safe. So we always book the hotel and rental cars after arrival. Maybe it's a little bit more expensive when you just do it on such short notice, but we fully believe it's more safe for general aviation flights. Uh, also a factor, um, what I just did, uh, we flew over a very nice uh, area uh, when getting to Figari and now we're getting our hotel there. How is it? Very good. Magnificent. What is it? It's a quiche and he has a croque monsieur. And I also have a croque monsieur waiting for me. No, <laughs> I'm not waiting for you. I'm not waiting, okay. He is asking the copyright. He is trying to film you filmer. <laughs> super friendly hostess um, our room is not ready yet but we got towels we got a, an umbrella and we got a ball and now we're going to, to some uh, to explore some beaches that um, we got recommended which should be absolutely stunning <laughs> So, we just arrived at our private beach. <laughs> oh. That's Can I rent the boat here? No boat, yes. We don't like boats. Just arrived here. Hello, 